Welcome back Stone Squad and welcome to all those new to the channel. Dan is Stone here and thank you for joining me today for some more Imperial of Rome playing as Macadon with the 1.5 Menander update. So in the last episode we continued our conquest in Greece. Uh, we have now got the site of the Olympic Games, Olympia, and we took Delph and Amphissa and a few other little things, which is pretty cool. And now we are going to focus on going to war against Athens. I want Athens and Eretria as well. These two we can take them out. I'll be really, 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 really incredibly happy if we could do that. So we are going to strike. So so first of all, let's check. What's your fort level here? Fort level 1. Fort level 1. So that's pretty good. So you guys can take that out pretty easily. Um, down here, Athens... Uh, what level is that? Fort level, level 2. So I'm going to need the main force. So what we're going to do is I'm going to bring you guys here. I will drop you off down on to... What is this? To Nagra? And we will launch an attack on Athens. And I'll probably bring you guys down as well just to help speed things up. Because I can definitely strike from multiple areas. Well, I could probably actually take out... Could I take out... Um, are these allied with them? Is it Epidoros? I I'm not sure. Who are they allied with? It is Epidoros. So we'll take them out as well. So let's move you guys all the way down. I don't want to move you guys. I could probably move you guys down here, I think. I'll move you there for the moment. Let's go. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's get things rolling. Get everything into place. I've got the claims. I suppose I could get some more claims going, to be honest. I've got the political influence, so I think we should get some. What about you? You're allied with Patri. Um, Horea, you're allied with quite a few people, actually. So, let's just get let's get claims going. Yeah, let's just do them. Let's do the claims. We might as well. Leprion. Oh, we've got a big defensive league. Okay, so there's some really big defensive leagues forming over here. Let's make claim there. Yeah, that's fine. That's enough claims for the moment. So obviously they are going to be start forming into defensive leagues since we are coming down like wild lunatics and killing everybody. What the hell? Who are all these disloyal people? Whoa, okay. And there's only one. Why does it say zero down here? I don't get that. Zero, 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 zero. Is it because... Is the people I've integrated? Yeah, this is really low. Wow. Yeah, there's a lot of people pissed. But then again, we have got the home country in ruin, so I might not integrate any more people, to be honest. I think Athens, I'm just going to burn the place to the ground. But that, that seems like the best thing to do. And by the way, you're on the boat. I completely forgot. So you need to go over here now. Into Chalkis. I might actually bring you guys over this side, to be honest. I think I will. I'll bring you over here. You can help. I think just 5,000 men there is not enough. And when your patience is a virtue, so this guy... Oh, he's a primary heir. Because Sandros, he wants to have a position in government. Well, I suppose I could give him something. The Elimoted. I could get rid of you and give this position to Cassandros. Where are you, Cassandros? You're there. Yeah, let's do that. Why not? Because he'll be happy and he should give us a little bit of cash. The more cash, the better. So, right. The main force is here. So you're going to go there. And I think we're pretty much ready to strike. I will get the navy and pop them on Athens to blockade their port so it speeds up the siege and stuff. So I think we're ready to go. So let's strike. Let's go bim, bam, boom. They bring in Epidaurus or tray, which is good. We can take them all out. And let's strike. Take Attica. Bim, bam, boom. We don't have a lot of aggressive expansion, so we need to make the most of it. Uh, you can go here. You can stay behind us in reinforcements. You're going to force march on this guy. We'll smash his troops before they actually do anything. Civic advances, pretty good. National commerce income, build costs, citizen output. All good stuff we could try to take. And I... Oh, I've, I've already built the mines. So they're currently building. Hopefully they'll finish soon. We can finish that mission. So Athens' army has been destroyed. Well, they've been smashed. Not destroyed, but they've been routed. What's this? Scholar of the Divine. Markatatos Alketid, by all accounts, has remained a scholar of the Divine Man for much of his life. It caused some embarrassment, therefore, when he would discover extorting a local temple to an egregiously unreasonable fee. Do I want 36 political influence and trade it off for 10 corruption? How much corruption do I lose per month? It doesn't, because I'm deceitful. So, I ain't taking the corruption here. We're going to do a slap on the wrist. I'll lose loyalty with the guy. A little slap on the wrist should do nicely. 
All right, let's go. So, martial advances. This is good. We can get extra discipline. I'm very tempted to spend some of that. Very tempted. Should I do that? Maybe when we get the gold. We'll see. Now we've got religious advances. That's good. That's even more. What's this? Oh, okay. Carthage has declared war on us. What for? Take Atolia. What? Okay, we need to finish this war off pretty quickly. This governor's pretty pissed, so I am going to bribe you very quickly. But I don't want you to... Yeah, I, I, I don't want you to be annoying. So what I need to do now is quickly take care of these guys. Very quickly. Carthage are going to be coming in with a lot of ships as well, I guess. They have 38. They don't actually have dominance of the seas. But I have a lot of forts in the area, so it is going to slow them down. But we do need to hurry things up. We really do. Orge advances. That's cool. So we need to pay close attention to what happens. Oh, how kind. He gives us gold. Thank God for that. Right, we're going to go for the discipline here quickly. Uh, yeah, extra 5% discipline it is always good to have. So we'll take that straight away. Since Carthage are here to try and kill us, I think it's a good thing to do. Oh, I forgot to take another status quo over there. Are you kidding me? Ariskos on a mastid died. You were the religious researcher. What if I was to give you a position? No, I don't think it's, it's too risky. I'll give it to this guy who's very loyal. And we have the... On the Mastid family who's pissed, I can get rid of a position for the Elimiotid or Antipatrid. You're good, I'm going to keep you. Um, is there anybody else here that I could do something with? No. What about you? Nope, nothing there. I could give it to you. He's only got one less. Let's give it to you. You're scorned. I'll hand that to you. Now you're loyal. Ah, oh, damn, now it's the... What? That didn't work. I did give it to the wrong one. Oh, oh, maybe they only had one position. So who can I get rid of now? Antipatrid or an Elimiotid? Maybe get rid of this researcher here and put someone else. Nope. Get rid of this Antipatrid. Yeah, let's do that. Let's get rid of this Antipatrid. I'll put you there instead. That solves the problem. We only have one disloyal character now. I'm just still very worried about Carthage. I'm incredibly worried. So I think I am going to increase the size of the navy very quickly. What do I have here? I have... Three hexes and four tetrias. Sorry, a couple of hexes and a couple of tetrias, I think. But let's go for... Let's go for maybe one, two... One, two, three, four... And then we'll go for five, six, seven, eight. Okay, that's an extra eight ships. And that should give us naval dominance. Does our Masapian allies have any ships? They don't. Yeah, we really need to hurry this up. Come on, people. We need to take over Athens. Epidoros, I might leave. I'm not overly bothered. I just want to finish this off, and then we can deal with Carthage. Because I can't fight multiple wars on multiple fronts here. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Let's hurry things up, people. 28% there. Oh, I can colonize. Yeah, let's quickly colonize it. Thank you. So that's now done. I've colonized all that. Oh, come on. 28%. Please fall. Nope. Now it's at 49%. I still don't know why Carthage wanted to kill us. It doesn't really make much sense. Bounce of a Harvest. Gain 200 gold or 3 stability. Well, it is obviously going to be the 200 gold. Do I have any quadro rooms? What is a quadro room, by the way? The one with the kind of horn up bit. I think it's this one. I think it's Tetris. Maybe State Harbor fees? National citizen output would be cool. Let's go for the nationals. No, actually, you know what? Let's save the gold for mercs. How many men do Carthage have? They only have 12 cohorts. That doesn't make any sense. Well, I'm going to save the gold, and I might actually push Carthage back. If we can... Ah, they're over here. Okay. 
Yeah, they have a lot more ships than I do, and they have better quality ones at that as well. So I probably should get some more ships. You know what? Let's build a few more. I could do with building a few more. Yeah, we'll build, we'll build a few more. I really do want naval dominance. Uh, Thrace want military access. That's not going to happen. And Mistria want glass. That is going to happen, though. That's going to give us a little bit of extra cash. Eritrea, the siege has been won. That is great stuff. Now we move forward. You guys are going to take all the rest of the stuff down here. Am I fighting down there? No, I'm not. Please, come on. Athens just needs to fall here. 57%. There we go. That's nice. Nicely done. Deal with you guys quickly. And then we shall focus on taking care of Carthage. So they've been dealt with. You're going to go and deal with this guy down here. Oh, I can't because that fort's blocking my movement, of course. We finished the mission here. I'm going to do the mines of Chalkidiki. It just gives us a little bit of extra slave output. We should help us have a little bit more money. Let's go and finish off this guy. I don't know what they're doing over here. They're trying to take care of my client. But they can do that if they want. That's not a problem. Um, the war goal is where I've got stuff. Very tempted to try and take some of Sicily. I could take something off them. I really would like to. Um, let's go and pick up some of the ships here. Yeah, let's go and pick up some of the ships. What's going on down here? You're sieging that. That's good. So we've taken all of this. So Athens, we should be able to finish them out. Can't move from there. I'm going to need the navy to move that over there. But do I want to take Epidauros? Probably not. Or do I? I think I do, actually. Before we do that, I'm going to go and pick these guys up. And I will join this navy. We can come and join down here. You guys can come and join here. Um, you guys still sieging. Oh, veterans move on. Mackinon gets 1,300 uh, manpower. We gain state-owned farmland in Thespia, which is good, which is more tax. But you're going to go on here now. And you're going to go down here now and take out Epidauros. Okay. Where's Carthage? They're still over there. We can still... I'm still confident of beating them. I, I think their war is just... I don't know. The stubborn bastards. That's all I can say. They're really, really stubborn. It's got port here. There isn't we're blockading it, which is the right thing to do. Do I have any more ships? No, I've got more coming. Got two over there. I'll pick them up when I bring the navy round. Um, what are these ships here? Triremes. Okay. Probably should make a few more. If I can afford it, we should. What's this? A parlous state. I'll lose, what, 100 gold and gain 6 stability? Or lose popularity? Yeah, I'm going to gain the 6 stability here. I want the 6 stability. What we got here? Nearly, nearly fallen. That's nearly fallen. And it has fallen, which is great. So can I separate piece of you guys? No, I can't because there's still a little bit of land here I haven't taken yet. This is at 0%. I want to finish you guys off. There we go. So they're dead. Now we should be able to take this and a separate piece out. So that's one guy gone, which is good stuff. What? I thought I got all your land. So what have they occupied that I don't have? Oh, of course. I need to take all this up there. And of course, they haven't taken that yet. I thought Thrace were taking it, but they haven't. So, do I go over there and try and take it off them or not? Probably not. Not just yet, anyway. Not just yet. I'll wait till we can. I'll wait till we take this and I'll peace out and then we'll deal with Carthage. Right, let's go down here quickly. Let's move. Let's go, let's go. That need even more men, even more navies. Scholar of the Divine. So Troilus on a mastid has by all accounts remained a scholar of the divine woman for much of her life. It's caused some embarrassment, therefore. Oh, she's extorted in the temple again. Yeah, I'm not gaining any corruption. It's like, no. I do have a fair amount of political influence. I could use it to do stuff here. Like, maybe another import route. Yeah, let's do another import route. Oh, yeah. 
There's some extra trade goods going. We need to go and help our client. I think I'll probably try and go. I'll probably go and try and free him. And then we could probably do something to Carthage. I really do want to do something to Carthage, to be honest. They are being annoying dicks, so I'm very incredibly tempted to do so. Um, right, come on. Let's finish this off. 42%. There we go. So, let the looting be gentle. I don't want to kill everybody. Let's sue for peace here. I could continue it for a little while, but I don't really want to, to be honest. I mean, I could take this over there, but for the moment, it's not my main priority. Because Carthage have attacked us, so we need to go deal with them. But let's do this. I think we take all that. That's fine. Um... I'm happy with that. We have to take control of Athens now, which is good. So, Conquests of Athens. So, the great city of Athens has finally fallen to our troops and is now in our hands. Athens was one of the two major factors, actors across the Peloponnesian War, as well as the heads of the Athenian League and those who struggled against Persian oppression. It is a known centre for philosophers from all around Greece, and for their particular democratic process is how their city state should proceed. After the Macedonians came into stage, uh, came to the stage of Greek politics, Athens had often sought to regain their power and independence. So I can either, the home of the philosophers will be unaffected by rule. The local pop happiness goes up. I take some artifacts back with us. And I kill some of the Athenian pops. Or we take everything. What do I do? Okay, let's have a look at the culture thing here. So where's the Athenian pops? Really not that many Athenian pops. So let's just leave it in pl Oh no, do I want to kill everybody? No, um, we're at war with Carthage, so I'm just going to accept them in. Um, the Eritrean elite, though, I'm just going to kill them, I think. We'll banish. We'll banish. Yeah, we'll, we'll banish them. We'll banish, we'll banish. So, now we have to get rid of this fort here. I don't want this fort here as well. It's just costing us way too much damn money. Athens, I'll keep the fort. Down here, I probably don't need as many now. So, like, this... I actually might actually keep them because it is increasing... It is reducing unrest. So I'm going to keep them for the moment, these forts. What about in Athens? A level 2 fort as well, just to kind of keep the peace. Um, yeah, we'll do that. You're going to stay over in Chalkis. You guys are going to go here. Let's go and pick... Let's get some more. Let's get some more ships. Should I get more more ships? How many ships do they have? Thirty-eight. How many do I have? Forty-four. Should I get some more? Yeah, I'm gonna get another couple, another two over there. I think. So you guys are gonna go and march all the way over here now. I'll probably force march you to be honest. I don't want to put you in the ship in case they, in case I cross them and they have like more ships than we do. Are you loyal? You are loyal. Um, why are you moving? Oh, I moved you, of course. So you're going to go on force march as well. I'll bring you over here. And we're definitely going to try and cross that damn strait. Um, this is going to go and pick up this navy here. We'll add them together. Then I'll pick up the two that are over here. And then we'll go and deal with Carthage. Anyway, showing up defences. The denizens of the city or the territory of Cassandrea have been feuding with their neighbours in Thessalonica. As a result, an impressive fortified wall is being erected. No, I don't want to fall. I'll gain 3,000 manpower, yes please. What's our maximum? 31,000. We're not too far off the max, actually. We're going to drill now, by the way. Ah, we have now. We have a lot of Greece. We do need to really focus on the rest after. We're not friends with anybody, so I could probably strike you down next after we deal with Carthage. Um, what about Megara? Yeah, we can take Megara down, because we can take Patre with it. So I think that would be a good thing next. Well, first of all, we deal with Carthage. The Carthaginians are the, one, the ones that are really annoying us here. So by the way, what is our Admiral like? I need to find out if we've got a decent Admiral or not. He's not bad. Do I have better? Yeah, I do. I have way better. But you're not loyal, so I can't put you in charge. Which is a shame. I can put you there, but again, you're not that loyal because you're deceitful. I suppose you could give the command to Ferris. What if I... I mean, what about that 10k stack? Who's in command there? It's a really good guy. I suppose we can give the command of the Navy to Ferris. That would work. Yeah, that would work. You've got really good martial ability, my friend. So we're going to go and come pick these guys up here. Yeah, let's go and pick them up. 
Anyway, the Olympiad, we hold them, so of course, every kind of Hellenic culture group will gain 20 opinion with us, which is nice. We have Starving Pops over here. We know Oh, damn, I forgot. I need to pick these guys up, don't I? I'll go pick these guys up first. Who do you want to trade? Precious Metals? Fine, we'll trade Precious Metals. I'm going to go and wipe out that 11k stack, man. That, is, that 11k stack is going to die. I can guarantee that they're going to die. I'll just bring everything we've got over there. We'll deal with them there, and then I'll probably try and take over some of Carthage's land in Sicily, I think. I could hand it to Masapia. That could work. It really could. Or we could just really just do a, f a fair bit of damage to Carthage. Oh, commercial ventures? Oh, okay, so you get a message now when you finish your um, um, provincial investment. That's cool. That's a nice little handy thing. Let's import something. What do I want to import, though? I mean, I've got enough food. Earthenware. Citizen happiness. Do I get any dice? We can get dice. Noble happiness. Yeah, let's get dice. The happier the nobles, the more they produce. Now, we don't make a lot of gold. Of course, I have increased the size of the navy. And we do have a lot of forts, which we might have to reduce at some point. Um, okay, so. Right, we're here. 44 ships. All joined together. Right, let's bring all these guys together. Let's move it. So you're going to go on there. The Olympic Games finish. We didn't win. Someone else did. But that's not a problem. We're now going to go and deal with that annoying 11k stack. So over we go. You're going to join in. I have no idea where his navy is. But it really doesn't matter. Just disembark. I want to capture the port so I can hide the navy. Can I actually catch you or not? I don't think I can. Um, so what I'm going to do, probably if I can force march. No, I can't. I'm going to go and hide these over here now. I don't need you to stay there. So I'm going to bring them both onto there. I'm going to try and take this city. I'm tying devotion. Gain some stability. Yes, please. So I want to wipe them off the face of the earth here. They are trying to bring in a few men, but it's not going to save them. Once we take this city, I can actually strike back. And then I'll definitely use the navy to ferry some troops across somewhere. And we'll do some damage to Carthage. Might as well have a little bit of fun. One minus seven percent. Two accused want to trade. That is also fine. Can I do anything here? What is our tech rate like? 89%. That's not bad, actually. It really isn't that bad. It could be better. But then again, I don't really have any reference to know how, what, how to really get the tech up now. Since you've got another pop category and stuff. Uh, foreign flight. So, a curious fanatic man appeared upon our borders today, claiming asylum from his captors in Phrynasia. Nah. Not the place for you. Go away. Oh, I do. Not gonna happen. And the thing is, I think I could stack wipe his troops here. If we kill him before the navy arrives, we can definitely stack wipe the guy. He's got a few elephants, though. Which is a bit of a pain. Now, I do want to free our, our, our client over. Well, free our client, because he's been occupied entirely. Troubling developments. Recently, we've seen that our Chancellor, Ordoleon Onomastid, as well as those under his charge, has been doing a disappointing job. Uh, apparently, you've been difficult to work with. I can lose two corruption, which I will do. I'll lose a lot. I'll take a lot to hit with the guy, but I'm not bothered. I'll lose a bit of corruption. Oh, come on, please fall. Please fall, please fall. Where is this Carthaginian troops? I haven't seen any, apart from on here. I think he's got his whole army over here. What a douche. Grace wants an alliance. Nah, sorry, don't need you guys. Oh, come on, please don't be stuck on a water shortage. Um, oh, I'm no longer importing dyes? Are you kidding me? Well, that didn't last long. Back glass. Our citizens are incredibly happy. Um, let's get some livestock. Why not? We can get the bonus for pop promotion speed. Why not? Why not? Why not? Okay, he is attacking us here. We are winning. Yes, there we go. Raising a host. So, Amnitas on a mastered in his capacity as general has begun using his own personal funds to augment the size of his army. Yeah, why not? You can gain some light infantry. I'm not bothered. You should gain it during the battle as well, which reinforces the army a little bit. I could always get rid of it. Yeah, I'm just going to get rid of them. I don't like having them. I don't like getting troops that I can't have control over. So, I choose what goes into the army, not you, my friend. Send you want an alliance, that's not going to happen. 
Okay, the siege there's finally been won, so let's move. Probably finish the guy off over here. Yeah, we can probably stack wipe him here and reduce his army to ruin. Which we have done. And I don't think they have many men now. Oh, they still have 24 cohorts. But we have got rid of a lot of them, unless it's just taken into account. No, they still have 24 cohorts to their name. Well, it doesn't matter. We can still, we can still, we can do a lot more damage to these guys other than peace out now. Let's go for the stability here. Thank you. Right, let's pop you guys around here. Um, well, no. Oh, yes, we're going in there. It's fine. These pirates are running away anyway. So we beat them. Beating of the Who's. So this is the Scythians of the Dahe. So that's way over um, over here. None of our business over this side. What do we do now? Well, I could merge these navy together. We still make a fair bit of money. I've got, wow, I've got I've captured a few more ships as well. Now we've got a big navy. I'm happy with that. I'll keep the 50 ships because I do like having control of the seas. It is quite useful. Um, there's no port there, so it's pointless using the ships to blockade. I'll bring them out anyway, screw it. What's the Carthaginian Navy? 38 ships still? Yeah, nothing's changed there. And I might be able to take do some damage in Sicily. I think we can, you know. Let's go and do some damage in Sicily. It might be an opportunity to grow our client, so... There's a good reason to do it. Come on, come on. 14%, 35%. Yeah, it should fall pretty soon. Let's have a look at our culture. Athenian have a few pops, but yeah, I'm not letting these pop. I'm not integrating the Athenian pops just yet. No way, my man. No way, no way, no way. Um, who wants to be friends? The Archon of Ambracia. Yeah, why not? Speaking of this, can I up the Salian Pops to Noble? I suppose we could. We can give them the same rights as... No, you know what? There's only going to be Macedonian Pops as Nobles. Yeah, let's have the Elite of the Pop would be Macedonian Nobles. And then the Salian and Epirot... Um, can be, or they can be, um, what's it, um, how to put it, they can be um, citizens, and then we'll have the other like small minor ones, will all be freemen, like contributing to the manpower and to the armies. Okay, so that's one, right, let's go. Have I got enough food here, by the way? I don't think I have, so I'm actually going to go back and get a bit of food, I think. Unless... Yeah, I'm going to go back here, we're going to stock up a little bit in Apollonia. Parthian hordes? So sensing, I've not seen this before. Sensing a moment of weakness, the hordes of the Parni, or Parni, uh, Parni Waste, have descended upon the Seleucid lands as a pack of wolves would savage a lamb. The attack came without warning, with Basilus Antiochus being amongst the first casualties. What? Whoa, okay, so this pretty much fucks up the Seleucid Empire. So, the Antigonids might use this opportunity to do something. If I was the Antigonids, I'll use this, like, instability to attack them. Let's see if they do it. Alright, so let's get you guys back over here. I'll try and get a little bit of food before I actually go back over there. So how much food are we getting in there per month? 10 per month. Here we're getting about 5 per month. Yeah, that's fine. And I do want to get them over there. We'll try and take over Carthaginian Sicily. Yeah, I don't want white peace just yet. No way. No way. Let's get a little bit more food. Speech of its successor. So as the ruler of one of the true successors to the great uh, empire of Alexander, Antipatros II steps up on a podium in front of our countrymen and court to deliver an inspiring speech. He brings up many empowering properties of the old conqueror. Or I get 10,000 manpower, or 100 gold, or 15 political influence, or his... Ooh, his deification? Six stability. What do I, I mean, I would like to get 10,000 manpower. I don't really need that, do I? I mean, we get, what, 161 per month. Let's get the gold. Gold is good. Gold is good. So we'll get a little bit of extra gold. I might be able to found a city, actually, somewhere. And I might found one here. Is this all Macedonia? It is, so we'll found a city there. Hell yeah. Let's get a city on there. We don't have a province capital here. So, that's going to be a good place. Alimio, it's on farmlands. It's a good location. We'll have it there. Let's call down an omen. What do I want? Probably change something here to be honest. I own this holy site and the global food modifier would be nice. Yeah, let's do Johnny Sauce. We'll swap that. I've got the stability to do so. And now we shall go for the research points again because I do like having extra tech. What's our tech level? 93%. That's not bad at all. It really isn't bad at all. 
So once these guys have got a little bit of food back, um, I just want to make sure you have enough food to maintain your campaign. And I think we have more than enough now. Oh, Bountiful Harvest. An extra 200 gold. Thank you. However, we have a potential civil war. Why? Because this governor is being a dick. Why are you so disloyal? I wish the governor of Greece. That's not good. Well, I'm going to bribe you. So it's the governor of Greece who's now being a dick. And I gave him power, didn't I? He's basically doing what he wants now. Okay, so can I bring you to trial? No, because you are so not corrupt, it is insane. And I should never really give you the position. But we're going to have to deal with this guy in a little while. But not just yet. First of all now, let's get you guys on the boat. And we'll definitely send you all the way over to the other side. And we'll start dealing some damage to Carthage. And I think that would be a good thing. If I can occupy this for Messapia, I would be really freaking happy. Maybe even try and take some of the islands here. Because if we can make a big client there, it would always be very useful. Um, but anyway, I am going to end the episode here. And the next one will definitely continue the war against Carthage. And then once that war's done, we should probably focus on taking care of the rest of the Greek mainland. But anyway, as per usual, thank you so much for joining me. If you enjoyed the episode, please don't hesitate to hit that like button down below. And if you want to see more Imperial Rome content, also consider subscribing to the channel. And with that said and done, thanks again for being here. And I'll hopefully see you all later. Bye for now.